Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video where today... Wait a second. I look a little bit different. Oh yeah, I'm playing Animal Crossing. Uh, I'm just going to be show you, showing you guys a tour of my island. Yeah, I'm just gonna be giving you guys a tour of my island starting from the airport let's go there via bowing so yeah um, so we're at the airport now once you get off the airport you just walk forward and there's some apples which is actually my native fruit and if you make a left then here's my little cafe area with fruit hello mr. gnome um, and then you make your way over here and there's another gnome clap for the gnome uh, and we have a little park area with a cool pool and lifeguard chair obviously there's a pool and yeah you can just sit here Enjoy everything. And then if you walk down here, there's a little picnic area. And here is Marshall's house. Up here, as you guys may have seen, is Nook's Cranny. And it's all upgraded in its upgraded glory. Now if you come up here, here is Resident Services. Here's my flag. I made it myself. Come over here, I just put gas station pumps because I felt like it. So if you come up here, up by my house go upwards there's a big flower garden like a huge flower garden with a ton of different flowers up here we've got some peaches here's where I breed my flowers I'm trying to get a blue rose but I'm too lazy to actually do anything oh yes up here is just empty space I haven't really filled it in with anything yet and then down here is where I'm going to put all of my villagers houses I've got one two Three people moved in so far and all of their no four people moved into the neighborhood so far and all of their um, places are themed after their house and their personality so if you head up here here's the menu for it We've got a retro diner up here with some board games and slot machine Oh, so close. We have a gnome enjoying the beautiful, uh, enjoying his drink. Up here, I should add some drinks up there. And over here, we kind of got like a hangout area. Got more houses over here, which will be moved. And then we head down here. We have a grove of peach and orange trees. And also there's a balloon. Pop that. Oh yeah, I have some nice bushes, some nice money inside the ground. Up here is my campsite, with the campsite sign. And then, if we come down here, here's where I have a little beach area. And also, there's these trees, just a bunch of random plain trees. And if you want to know why, because I don't have trees anywhere else on my island. If you have exactly 17 trees on your island, then every single tree will have something special on it. So the reason you hold the net is just, you just spam A whenever the, you see a wasp. And yeah. Ah uh, yes, this is the Statue of Liber, as you can see. Definitely the Statue of Liberty. Definitely. And also it has many fans. Yeah, it seems yeah, it seems to have many fans. So yeah, we have Able Sisters up here. And then back here where there's no path is just my little storage area with probably rotten turnips, right? Yep, amazing. But yes, here's more fruit trees. Fruit trees fruit that is not native to your island gives you so much money. If you're a uh player that is new to the game it actually gives you a 
buttload of money if you have like as many orchards as I do. So yeah, selling fruit that's not native to your island gives you so much money. It gives you like, I think 350 per uh, fruit. And then also, we have my musical area. I have lots of songs. I kind of collect songs. And I also have some secret songs. I also have a Godzilla statue. Uh, that's my island. You know what time it is, guys. Time to check out Marshall's house. Marshall doesn't play that often, so... Uh, his house is kind of small. But he does have a race car bed. Which is really cool. And, yeah. Okay, guys. It's actually time to check out my house. We can go there. Via bowing. Oh, man. That's very convenient. Okay. So, we just walk into my house and here it is I'm not completely done upgrading my house as you can see I don't have a basement but here's my living room got a little Newton's cradle here and then I've got of course beautiful Nintendo switch I have a little seahorse lamp over here in my vacuum I have a clock up here looks amazing and then a sofa if I want to watch TV. Let's head into the kitchen. So yes, here here's my kitchen. It's pretty cool. I've got all of the posters of all the villagers I've had or do have. Uh, you can see them up there. We're gonna go visit them, the ones that are on my island currently. I'm actually missing one, but yeah, here is my kitchen. So next, we're gonna go into the all-important bathroom. Yeah, it's amazing. Yay. So we've got a little drawer with some tissues over here. Got a sink. Got a mirror so you can change your hair. Got a beautiful, beautiful changing room with... Uh, I tried my best to recreate Mona Lisa, but with Dom's face on it. I tried it as best I could, okay? Toilets. Lots of toilets over here. With a security camera, obviously, we need to watch you while you're going to the toilet. The next room we're gonna head into is my bedroom. It's a pretty nice bedroom. I uh, got that very calm music in the background. I got a little sofa here. I have on my wall a world map. I've got a bunch of plaques up there. Got my bunk bed, my chair, reading magazines. I do like stuffed animals. I have plenty of stuffed animals over here. I also love pandas, so I have pandas everywhere. And also this cute little doggy. And I have a hamster. And a bed for my hamster for some reason, even though I don't really let him out of the cage. So yeah, that's my bedroom. Beautiful. The last room is kind of a nonsense room, which I have gotten, I just made it from the new update, the second summer update. Let's go up there. I just kind of made it quickly. So then I've got the fireworks, I've got a little exercise area over here, and I've got a bed where I can sleep. So, if you didn't know, in this new update, you can dream with the dream suite. So, you just go up to the bed, press I want to sleep, and then you'll be brought to this place with this person named Luna. And it, actually, you guys can visit my island without having to interact with me or being able to mess it up. So you just want to press I want to dream, but I'm actually going to 
uh, show you guys the code. So my dream address is on screen now. So if you want to visit my island, then you just have to press I want a dream. Then you, it'll connect you to the internet. And then you just type in my dream address, which is on screen now again. And then when you're done, you can wake up. So the last thing we are going to do before we leave is I'm going to show you what villagers I have in my island. So yeah, let's go. The first villagers I actually got was Dom. I don't think he's here. Yep, he's not here. Let's try to find him. Two thousand years later. Okay guys, I looked around. I can't find Dom. But yeah, here's what Dom looks like. And he's actually a new villager. So lots of people really want him. I actually got him. These two villagers are the first ones I started with. And he's a really sought after villager, so. Yeah, I really like him. He's a really good villager. And then my other really good villager I got first was Phoebe. This is like, the first two villagers I got were like the best villagers that I could ask for. And yeah, so let's talk to Phoebe. I gave her that dress. So yeah, let's talk to her. Uh, I think I've already talked to her a little bit today. Yeah, you do look good in that. Yeah, I got you that dress. I was literally just talking about that. So now I'm going to show you guys the next set of villagers that I got. So the next person I got was Piper. Uh, she lives in this house right here. I don't know exactly where she went. But, yeah, the next villager I got was Piper. Here's the little patio I set out for her. I'm gonna see if I can go find her. A few moments later. Yeah, I can't find Piper either, but I don't know where she is. But yeah, I'll put what she looks like on screen right now. Uh, that's the villager that I got. Third. So the next villager I got is actually on the other side of the island, so let's go over there. Now, I will interrupt your regularly scheduled new, not scheduled, video, I guess, to give you this short moment of cuteness, presented by Clay. Okay, I guess you're done. Right here, that's what she looks like. Let's go visit her. The next villager I got, her name is Blanche. Ah, yes. So, one of my villagers, specifically Dom, he had a catchphrase that was indeed a roo as you guys might know if you do play animal crossing and you have dom so she asked me for a new catchphrase i said it was no cap now if you don't know what no cap means it basically means i like i'm not lying aka indeed a roo so you see where i'm getting at so he had that catchphrase and then he literally told everyone on my island and Everyone now says no cap. Yes, my bold aloha shirt is very summery. No cap. A thing or three? See a Blanche?
Now, the next villager I got is that bundle of cuteness you saw earlier. Possibly one of my favorite villagers. Don't tell all the other ones, but... Here, lean in a little closer so I can whisper it. My favorite villagers are Clay and Dom. Ah, I think Clay is in his house. Yes, he is. And here's Piper! Hi, Clay. Oh, you're sleepy? Oh, yes. Feels like a birthday party. Or even a regular party. With everyone over. Yeah, it does. It really does. I gave him that vest that he's wearing. He doesn't usually wear that. I gave him that, and I thought it matched perfectly, and he really liked it. Here he goes saying no cap again. Oh my, what is that noise? What is that face? Yes, I'm glad it fits your butt perfectly. And and I'm glad that you're not... I'm glad to see that you're not even using it. Like, literally... But you have... You have a jar... I hope you guys liked that video of a tour of my island in Animal Crossing. Yeah, thanks for watching. If you want more Animal Crossing videos, like the video. And if you are new, then go ahead and subscribe. Uh, see you guys next time. Bye.